Now here at Activated Decor, they've done some incredible things when it comes to television storage. Here we have a piece that holds a television set, and what's incredible about this is it's an existing piece. Basically, they've taken the drawers, removed the back of them, sealed them up, and the TV is in here, and it goes up and down. So you can use existing pieces if you want, and it's great to hide things. Over at this one, it comes up, and it actually, when it comes up, swivels. So this is a wonderful solution when the cabinet is on one side of the fireplace, and you want to angle it, and you want to get that view. So I love the fact that it angles. Great solutions. Now over here, you may think that you lose the storage, but you don't lose the storage at all. In this particular unit, they've got a bar. So what you have is you still have the storage, and with plasma televisions, it only takes up a very small space. So incredibly creative solutions to hiding the television. That's like, that's like a magic show. <laughs> Look, there's nothing underneath. <laughs> and they take the baton and go, see, there's nothing underneath. It's not the best. That no. is, why do we like that so much? We like that saying to the ladies behind me, because it's cool. Mm -hmm. It's cool. It's but, so cool. But it works. It see, does. that's... Activate Interiors does a telescopic one, where the old-fashioned ones used to be these scissor lifts, and they'd be like shaking as they go up. Oh, the TVs weighed so much, so the TV was shaking. Sure. And they would, but the problem with those is when they went down, often the cords got tangled and cut. Oh. Where this is like a telescopic up and down, nothing can get stuck. And because the plasmas are so thin and light nowadays, they're, they're so quiet, it's fabulous. For someone like... Um, what was, what was your, your Maria. person? Maria. Maria. For someone like Maria, if she didn't want to do built-ins, to put a, a little mm. French chest like that beside the TV. And what I did in my place down south is I have that unit from them. And then the TV is sort of off-centered in the cabinet. So one part of the cabinet has all the components in it. I was going to ask And Liz one part, though, yeah. the TV comes up. Sure. But from the front, the doors look symmetrical. Yeah. So when you see the piece sitting there, it's just this beautiful cabinet. Yeah. And then the TV mm. comes up, and I have a painting on the wall above it. Because the, the... Nice. Well, so I didn't have to ruin the sometime. wall. Mm. So I didn't have... Yes. Yeah, so well. But you know what I want? I, 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 it's Great. the components. I was saying to Maria during the course break. It's the components I wish they could make the big. components three yeah. inches deep. And that's why you said with those built-ins, that's why they have to be deeper, those shelves, for if you're going to do built-ins. Yes. With, you know, if you're well, if, if you've you got hide your television away. And, yeah. and also what you can do is with wiring, you don't have to have the components underneath the television set. Yeah. So we did a house where the plasma was by the fireplace, but there was a big end table beside the sofa, and that had all the components uh -huh. in it. And the wire went down, and if you have a house where the basement's unfinished, it's much easier because you can take it into the wall, run it through the open ceilings, and pop it up That's through the floor. So, cool. so you don't have to have the components right at the television set. Right. It can be mm -hmm. off to in another cabinet. Suddenly, half the audience is going, great, I have an unfinished basement. <laughs> it's going to be You can drill floor plugs everywhere. Everything. It's great having an unfinished basement. I love it. 